I'm super excited to introduce you to Becca Davis, who's the owner of SCG Fitness right here on the west side of Santa Cruz. And I've just started coming here and I love it. <laughs> we paid her to say that. No, they didn't. I actually <laughs> paid them to come here and I still love it. How did you find out about wanting to do yeah. this? Did somebody, like, what doors open? What, how how's the opportunity presented? I went to school to open a gym. It was always my dream. I kind of, like, put it on the back burner as I was, like, progressing in my career. My first year of college uh, shifted. I was, I had gotten a job at a local uh, small gym, and I was working in their child care, and the fitness director at the time was like, well, if you don't want to do that, if you want to try personal training, I'm happy to mentor you. And so I was probably like 19. I started doing personal training, and then I put myself through college doing personal training and realized that I wanted to continue to move up. And so I got my um, degree in business. It was really important to me. I was getting the fitness part of it. Um, I really wanted to learn how to run a business, how to manage people. So I got my degree in business management and got my first management job literally like five days before I graduated from college. That's cool. They were like, can you start Friday? And I was like, well, I'm going to graduate on Friday. And then I'm going to start <laughs> Monday. I'll be here at 7 a.m. Yeah. And then I literally worked in every different position for this company. Like I oversaw housekeeping and childcare and we had pools and personal training. And like I oversaw at group fitness. I taught spin classes, I taught step class, like we did all of it. And so I was with that company for like eight years probably, like and over time just worked my way up. And then I actually left the fitness industry briefly to go into the construction industry. So then I, I came back in to the fitness industry after I was with that company for about four years. Um, I had my daughter while I worked for them and actually started working uh for a nonprofit, the JCC, over in Los Gatos. So okay. I oversaw their fitness center. And then I opened here. I had a friend approach me and say, is this, is this something that you want to do? And it, I'm that person that, like, if I get on a path, I'm like, I always say no first to everything, which I'm working <laughs> on, because I'm an all-in person. Yeah. And I'm not going to um, promise that I can do something if I don't really think I can do it. Yeah. And so I kind of got down this path and I like things started to happen where I was like, this may be a possibility. And so I just, I spent a month of, okay, I need to uh, like location, all the things, right? Location, equipment, business structure, mission statement. Like these were like really important things to me. And I felt like if I could get those things to come together, everything else would just kind of fall into place. Yep. You know, I'd been in the fitness industry 15 years or so, and I, two years in, am still learning stuff every day. What adversities and challenges have you experienced with, like, from vision to opening? I talk about this a lot, but like this pivoting of my brain to go from like being our accounting department to then being our HR department. Do you do it all? I do it all. And to then coaching, to then going and doing one-on-one -on -one personal training, and then hopping onto our social media and trying to put together these like really exciting things so that people know who we are. Yeah. And then, oh, and then also marketing, you know? And yeah. so, and, and that really is the definition of a small business owner. That's, your that's how thing. it works. I had never built that from the ground up. The goal is to build a business. Yep. You have to have the foundation. Mission based was very important to me, but then the next thing is if we're going to keep our doors open to meet this mission, you have to structure it a certain way. And that was like another thing where you're like, okay, I want to get good people in here. Mm -hmm. I want to make sure that like, like to keep this place clean like this. Yeah. I mean, we're going to have like, you got to bring staff in. I can't, originally I was the only person cleaning and I was like, okay, this isn't sustainable. <laughs> I can't be the only one mopping the floor and making sure that like my staff is taken care of in the way that they need to be taken yeah. care of and our members are taken care of. It's okay to ask for help and it's, it's also okay to not be there all the time. Yes. So I was literally hiring people saying, we're building the plane as we fly. Yeah. This is my, we have no wings. Yeah. And so we're like, we're doing this yeah. 
together. But that's great though because they could put they could give you their input. Totally. And that's gonna be more valued on their end than if you're just like, here you go. Yeah. Do it like this. Right. But if they're like, well, I totally. have this vision and it's gonna make it better because we can only see so much as business owners yes. that like their input's valuable in yeah. achieving your ultimate goal too and keeping them happy and keeping you happy. Totally. Absolutely. So my name is Erica. I am a coach at SCG Fitness. I've been here from day one. So yeah, we op well, Becca opened the gym and invited me to be a coach here. So um, I've been doing CrossFit for a really long time and I was at another gym and then coaching here. And the more time I spent here, I realized that SCG's goals aligned with my personal goals. And so it was an easy transition from my old gym because it's always hard to leave a gym. But like once I was here more, I was like, all right, this is where I belong. You talk a lot about, or I've heard you talk a lot about creating a culture. And I think that's huge. I think that sets you apart from like other places that I've experienced because totally. you had and that's where I see you incorporating like your love of fitness with also your business mind yeah. and bringing it together and like having a very concise vision about yeah. what you want. I really like the community. I feel so supported and embraced and there's so many different types of people and shapes and all of that. So it feels just really welcoming. I agree. It's the community here that I really love because it in the past it was really hard for me to stick with a fitness plan and feel motivated and here I feel so supported. My favorite thing about my job is the people. I love our members. I love coming in if, like I, after I work at the hospital then I get to come in here and be with all these people who are invested in their health and well-being. I was initially not excited or enthused. <laughs> um, I was kind of dragged here and I have absolutely loved it and the enthusiasm and the camaraderie in the group has really been fun. Yeah, I mean, even from our name, right? SCG means support, connect, grow. So, I didn't know that. Yeah, and most people don't, so I put I it in like that. like Santa Cruz gym. That's right, yeah. <laughs> it has to go SC because yeah. SC is Santa Cruz, yes. which is also obviously a huge part of who we are. Yeah, and the community that you're totally. supporting. Totally. I love it, that's yeah. brilliant. So we support people. Um, not only in this space, but supporting the wider community. We connect people to other people who are like-minded to help keep them coming and motivated. And then we believe in the growth mindset, which is just all about like failure is part of the process. It's okay to come in here and not kill yourself every day and that we're just here to learn and that we're accepting feedback, not only from the coaches, but also from our members and that this is like a whole community. I believe that we need to meet people where they're at. I believe that everyone has a place here. I'm just happy people are here and I want everyone to feel safe and welcome and get something out of a class. And um, it's achievable. Yeah. Yeah. So you can do it at your own pace and you can challenge yourself if you want to or you can, you know, take it easy if that's what you need that day. Um, they help you with every single level. I was always very intimidated by CrossFit. Um, I only just recently started doing more of the CrossFit classes, but I love it. They help you so much. You never feel if you're doing anything wrong. I mean, if you are, they'll call you out on it. <laughs> <laughs> they should. That's their job. Where do you but, see yourself going in the future in SCG Fitness? I, at this point, just want to reach more people. You know, I mean, this is our space, and, like, we can only have so many people in here, but I really do want to reach more people. So whether that is multiple physical locations, um, I'm looking into online stuff, which I was, like, never, that really wasn't my original vision, but, again, I think that's part of what you have to do as yeah. a business owner super important to me that we do it as I call it like SCG style. Our style is creating programs that we can actually support people and mm -hmm. actually make a change in their life. I think what differentiates SCG from other gyms would be the time and investment in like each individual person and like finding out what your specific needs are what and meeting you where you're at. Like we really tailor, even though they're group classes, we tailor everything to each individual member. The people I have in the program are so different where they're at in their journey. And so I'm like putting in different levels for them so they know what level to pick. Um, and then just ultimately kind of like tailoring it to what they need. That's cool. We also offer nutrition coaching. So one-on-one -on -one nutrition coaching. Um, as you said, one-on-one -on -one personal training. We have our group classes that's like part of a membership. And then 
we also have an open gym membership. So for people that just want to come in, kind of do their own thing, mm -hmm. um, and then all of our members that have access to the classes also have access to come in and work out on their own. Programming is all done in-house, so it's literally built for our community. I love that. We're not getting it off of a website. That was really important to me. So we're literally, like, evolving it to, like, what's working for our community. I love that. Which was, again, so important to me. Yeah. So I just have to say, if you want to check out SCG Fitness and come talk to Becca, she's amazing. The gym is amazing. I love it here. We've been here for like two months now. I wouldn't go anywhere else. To just give it a try and come a few times. And if you sense, you know, the, the camaraderie, I think is important, but you've got to come a while for that. Yeah. Um, but you learn how to do things right and you get a good sweat and then you get to go home. I've been here about a year and a half now, and I got my neighbor to join, I got a couple other friends to join, and I am so much of a better person, not quite fitness model level yet, but um, I'm just so much happier mentally, physically, I feel so much stronger. Um, don't listen to the thoughts in your head, just put your feet on one or another and get here. No reason to, to win.